And she took a family recipe and turned it into a thriving business. We're checking out a local baking company that's one of Chicago's very own. You're watching Chicago's very own WGN News with Steve Sanders, Michael Mater, and Tom Skilling. This is Chicago's very own WGN Midday News. So how's this for a business model? A Northside mom on maternity leave starts making banana bread at home. Like she's got extra time after having a baby. I guess so. <laughs> but she named yeah. the bread after her daughter, Hannah, and it's grown into an enterprise. WGN's Jane Bull introduces mm -hmm. us to one of Chicago's very own. It all started with her grandmother's banana bread recipe. We took a classic family favorite of mine that I grew up eating. Lisa Spinner had a new baby and a three-year-old when she started baking and selling banana bread to local coffee shops and stores. So tired, she often fell asleep in the kitchen between bake runs. My husband would come down to leave, usually to go off to travel, and he would help me rotate the trays, wake me up, and hand the baby to me to nurse. Eight years and a half a million loaves later, Hannah Banana Bread baked goods are currently in 750 grocery and specialty stores across the nation. These make them nice and even. The Hannah Banana Bread grew so quickly that Lisa could no longer keep up with the orders. She had to outsource the massive amounts of measuring, mixing, pouring, baking, and shipping. They're home baked and they're home scratch. They're scratch baked, as you see. Everybody still portioning them out by hand. Four years ago, Lisa's husband Peter took a leave from his job. They now work as husband and wife team, selling, creating, marketing their specialty baked goods. It's certainly a lot bigger than when Lisa started in our kitchen. After the sweet success of mixing chocolate chips into the banana bread, they went crazy with mix-ins. Blueberry banana bread. White chocolate chip caramel walnut banana bread. And it's a mouthful to say and eat. It's one of our number one sellers. And then um, we do a butterscotch caramel as well. Lisa believes the secret to success is if you have a good idea and it just keeps nagging at you, do it. Having something that you believe in and sticking with it. It's blind passion going in. Now Hannah, Dad, and all four of their kids have a bread named after them. I added Peter Pumpkin bread as well as Declan's Irish soda bread, John Apple's cinnamon bread, and our newest is the Dee Dee's coffee cakes. A Chicago's very own entrepreneurial family. Jane Bowl, WGN News. So the, for those with food allergies, yeah. Hannah Banana now makes a gluten-free line, too. Always thinking. Does Hannah Montana know about this? That's what <laughs> I wonder. If you want more information on the story or if you'd like to send your own Chicago story idea, go to WGNTV.com and then under segments, go to Chicago's very own. We'll be right back.